Ensure the liner is dry and free of mud and other contaminants. Overlap the adjacent pond guard panels by a minimum of four inches. Allow the pond guard panels to relax. Mark the overlap with a white marker to ensure the pond guard returns to the placement after priming. Tack back the overlap of the top pond guard panel using quick prime as an adhesive. Using a scrubber pad and holder, apply the quick prime plus primer to the bottom surface of the top pond guard panel and the top surface edge of the bottom pond guard panel. Test the primer flash off by touching the primed area with your finger and pushing forward at an angle. The primer should not string as your finger is moved up and away. Adhere the three inch quick seam splice tape to the primed surface of the bottom pond guard panel. Check the quick seam splice tape alignment to avoid fish mouths or folds in the tape. Expose one quarter inch to one eighth inch of the tape outside the overlap. Remove the release paper and allow the top pond guard panel to fall across the tape while pulling the release paper away at a 45 degree angle. Use a broom to brush over the splice to solidify the adhesion. Check for fish mouth folds and smooth out as necessary. Using a hand or stand-up roller, roll the seam longitudinally and across the seam in overlapping sections to mate the seam together. Using a compressed air source, test all bonded seams using a minimum 50 psi air supply directed through a 3 16 inch nozzle held within 2 inches of the seam edge. Note, do not exceed 75 psi or it may cause damage to the seam. When using Firestone products, follow all appropriate safety guidelines.